Hi, Danny Morrison here for the Danny Morrison Expert Comments alongside Rerio.com and uh, Matchbox 50. That's right, key match 50 of uh, season 14, the India T20. And it was there in Dubai where you've had the DCs. That's right, they uh, played in last year's final against Mumbai. Uh, up against one of the other big powerhouses, big guns, in terms of this uh, wonderful league that's been going since 2008 in CSK. Now, Dhoni didn't win the toss, went the way of the DCs, and so Rishabh Pant said, look, we're going to have a uh, field first. Let's see what you can get, CSK. Well, a bit of a lone ranger um, in terms of the batting and what they could post was Ambati Raidu. Now, he was uh, not out 55 from 43 uh, in terms of five fours and a couple of maximums, but really there was no one else again. It, it seems to be a bit of a pattern here uh, in this season of the India T20 that one guy tends to do it on his own and, and the others maybe not quite enough from the other protagonists. Um, Dhoni chipped in with an 18, but it took him 27 balls. And, and Robin Utapa, a runner ball 19, just wasn't really good enough. And so when you look at that being, you know, a total of 136 for five in 20, um, was always looking a little thin on the ground, given that this pitch was a goodie. And um, I was there with uh, my colleagues on the Sunday um, for that match. And um, really the pitch uh, is, is better than a 136, most definitely. So... When you look at the bowling, uh, we all know that pace off the ball, everyone wants a wrist spinner, everyone loves a wristy, um, but when you've got the quality of Aksha Patel, left arm, finger, and Ravindra, old uh, Ashwin, Ravi Ashwin, poof, um, I think it does make a difference. You've got that variety in your bowling attack. Uh, and certainly, when I look at Aksha Patel, uh, he's developed and come on massively because of this league, able to develop that talent coming through in India. Uh, is huge. And so what, uh, two for 18 in, in four overs, half a dozen dot balls, and in conjunction with uh, Ravi Ashwin, the, the senior pro, um, you know, his one for 20 uh, in four with eight dots really was uh, outstanding for the DCs. When I look at the reply to that, it just had to be a little bit controlled, nothing outrageous. And so you left that to a young uh, star um, coming through, Shimron Hetmar from the CPL, he hung in there when it was needed because Shikha Darwin laid the pat for him. He had a, a star in, out of India for a long time, one of the old hands uh, in terms of Shikha Darwin with his 39 from 35, um, a couple of maximums and three fours, but it was Shimron Hetmar at the end. 28 not out from 18, just kept things together. And uh, whilst he wasn't fabulous at the uh, CPL in the Caribbean, he showed again glimpses of his talent uh, and what he's capable of, and hopefully the maturity that's starting to embed for uh, Shimon Hetmeyer. Uh, yeah, he had a couple of fours and a six, and he got them over the line in the end. Um, they got there, uh, seven down, sure, with a couple of balls to spare. And you got to think that you know it's tough when you're up against a very good bowling and lineup. When you look at that uh, CSK, the men in yellow, um, Shudal Tako. Uh, again, two for 13 with a dozen dot balls in his four overs. And of course, Jadeja, again, good finger spinner, left arm variety, uh, superb. And when I look at him, uh, he got 10 dots, two for 28, and it kept the DCs just in check for a little bit. So it made it interesting. It took them 19.4 overs to get there. So they did it with two to spare, comfortable enough. Um, but again, not ideal in terms of thinking, you know, we're going into the playoffs very shortly. So in the end, Aksha Patel, man of the match, and the DCs getting up with three wickets to spare and two balls in the tank.